All right, snow plow bracket insulation on a 2003 Chevy Tahoe. First, you gotta take the lower bumper part off. And then it goes into the side here, like this, on the side of the frame. Take this bracket, it goes into the side of the frame, fits into that hole, like so. Then you put a ball in there. Then you put that in the frame. Well, I, obviously you gotta take the, um, the nuts off for that ball. Put it in there and it goes in there and that bolts down like that. And this is from, what company is this? Snowplowsonline.com. And the same thing on this side. This side, he's actually got it almost set up. What kind of bolts were holding that lower bumper valance in? Clips. Clips? Yes. Then you just take the clips out of that lower part of the bumper and it should come right out. Obviously, you have to unplug the, um, the fog lights. That's the fog light connector. Let's pull that tab down. And it unclips and you pull it out. Same thing on this side. And that's the new ball. It comes with it in the kit. Put it through the um, clutch. Show them how it goes. You have to wiggle it around a little bit. It doesn't always fit perfectly. Missed. <laughs> there you go. You slide that in. Put the nut on the other end. Make sure you put the lock washer in there. That's also supplied with the kit. You tighten that up. And you tighten that lower bolt up. And then you put this piece here on. I'm not sure where they got this piece from, but customers supplied it. And obviously it's not new, but that goes on to the bottom part of that, um, that bracket. And that's pretty much it. That's pretty much the hard part right there, is figuring out how to get the brackets in. The instructions that come with it are not very clear at all. So hopefully this helps somebody out who's struggling to figure it out with the instructions that's provided. And that's from snowflowersonline.com. And this is for a 2003 Chevy Tahoe.